Hello, my name is Natalie Reed, and uh, welcome to this webinar all about the crystal hallmarks on our ocean cruising. So on our ocean cruising, we have just two ships, Crystal Symphony and Crystal Serenity. Did you know that these two ships have won more awards than any other cruise line in the world? Not just any other cruise line, but any other resort or hotel in the travel industry's history. We continually win the highest accolade available from Condé Nast Traveller, which is voted for by our customers. And last year, we got the hat trick. Best ocean, best river, and best yacht. So what makes Crystal so special and why do we win so many awards? Well, let's start with Crystal Serenity, our newest ship. Um, 980 customers. But actually, the size of our ships is what's unique and special about Crystal. Crystal Serenity is 68,000 tonnes. To be carrying under 1,000 guests is very, very unique. We have, for every one and a half customers, we have a member of crew. So this means that you have funds with the crew and you have all the service levels that you would expect and the intimacy from a small yacht lighting experience ship but because of the size of the vessel you have all the choice and amenities that you maybe want from a larger cruise ship so when you combine those two elements together that's what creates the special substance that makes crystal so special so unique and award-winning crystal symphony is our second ship she's um she's actually our smaller ship and uh, she's my favourite, but I think that's only because she was the first ship that I ever went on. So I've got a special romantic uh, memory of Crystal Symphony. Um, so slightly higher guest uh, staff ratio, 1.7, but the uh, per guest space ratio is 60.2, so with 848 customers. So in 2017 and 2018, which seems like a long time ago now, but in 2018 was only a couple of years ago, we spent over $100 million re, um, dollars on refurbishing our two ocean ships. And I'm going to just talk through to you now a little bit about what we did as part of our evolution of, of Crystal Luxury. So one of the first things we did is we introduced more suites, more penthouses. And this is because, um, actually, these are really popular on Crystal. And... In the luxury market, the demand is, is definitely there for people that want to have larger suites with big walk-in wardrobes, private butler experience. So we introduced our sea breeze penthouses. And you can see that down in the bottom hand corner there. They're really light, really contemporary, lovely big walk-in showers. So they're very, very popular with um, introducing a new client to Crystal. We also introduced innovative dining options. And two that I have to mention are up on the top deck, and they have this alfresco fill, the churrascaria, and then also silk. Now, this area here that you can see with the swinging chair is the cocktail bar, or the seating area just outside of silk. You see silk in the distance um, with the um, green foliage in the background, but I don't know if you can see in this picture, but there's twinkling lights all up underneath the glass roof, and there's twinkling lights all around. The atmosphere in the evening that this creates is just really, really magical. It's beautiful, so romantic. And um, this is becoming one of our most popular restaurants now. And because we've introduced these two restaurants up on the top, we're now able to go open dining on our main waterside restaurant. And another reason, of course, we'll be able to go to is because we've reduced our customer numbers. We've reduced our customer numbers by um, nearly, I think it was, well, I think it was well over 100. Um, but we kept the same amount of staff levels. One of the other things is we enhanced all our technology. You know, we have free Wi-Fi across our fleet. But what's the point of having free Wi-Fi if it doesn't, if it's slow and buffer and buffers all the time? So yeah, I'm not very technological, but one of the things we spent a lot of money is making sure we have really great high-speed Wi-Fi available to all our customers. And then um, a lot of the public areas were also really updated as well. Um, this, and you can just see underneath, um, it's just a small picture, but this is um, Palm Court on Crystal Serenity. I was on Crystal Serenity last year, and it's now one of my favourite places. It has a really romantic, um, very contemporary atmosphere. 
So what are the main hallmarks that set Crystal apart? And why do people continue to return to cruise with us and award us the best cruise line in the world? Well, all inclusive. This is really, you know, a big thing that I want you to think about. Because if a customer has come into you, they might not have considered an ultra luxury cruise all inclusive. Quite often they feel that it will be out of their price range. And often or not, what we're not looking at is what the value of all inclusive. So what they would spend on their cruise versus what they would spend when they step off their cruise. The thing with Crystal, everything's included apart from spa treatments, which you would, of course, expect, and shore excursions. Now, just to confuse you, on our yachts, on our ocean, on our expedition, we do include shore excursions. But that's because if we look at the price point of an ocean med cruise compared to a week on a river cruise for the same amount of time, you will notice a difference. A river cruise will be slightly more expensive. And that's because a river cruise customer expects all the excursions to be included. It's very much a city break on water. Whereas an ocean cruise customer, because we have a lot of repeat customers, we asked them, do you want shore excursions included? And the answer was no. The reason being, they're going to Monte Carlo, for example. They just want to have a potter around. They don't feel that they need to do an insurance and they would rather the price point reflected that. Um, the other things you have to look at is the all-inclusivity. It's not just all about alcohol. Obviously, it is amazing. And if you have fine um, wine, cust customers that appreciate fine wine and amazing food, then Crystal is a no-brainer for you to be offering them. Um, but, you know, specialty coffins. A lot of cruise lines, they might have a cost of coffee on board, but every time you go, every time you go and use it, you have to pay for that service. And Crystal, that's all included. Speciality dining. All the restaurants on Crystal are amazing. But one of our speciality dining restaurants is Umi Uma. And this is no boot restaurant. And that will set you back, if you can get a table in Berkeley Square in London, up to £300. I think it's £350 for a tasting menu each. And that's without the pairings of the wine. Well, when you consider you can cruise with us for under £2,000 for a week, already you're starting to see the value of Crystal All Inclusive. The enrichment programs, I'll talk a little bit more about those, but they are amazing from the daytime. It's an in-house joke that there's more to do days at sea with us than there are on the days of port, right through to the amazing entertainment. And the nightly entertainment, Tony Award winning, unlimited Wi-Fi, and of course, we're British. We hate paying gratuities, so all your gratuities are included. Six-star service. Um, we hire our staff based on their attitude, not the skill. Maybe the uh, the chefs and the captain, they might need a little bit of skill. Um, but, you know, generally, you can't teach somebody a personality, but we can teach them the crystal way. We spend a lot of money and time and investment on training our staff. And we really look after them. We have the highest retention of staff in the cruise industry. Quite simply, if you look after your staff, they will look after your customer. And it's it really is as simple as that. Um, of course, we have 24 hour room service. And one of the things that's really popular and why we've introduced more suites is whenever you take one of our, any of our penthouse, penthouse suite or a penthouse or crystal penthouse, it comes with your own private butler. Space, whether it be one of our brand new suites, um, right up to the amazing crystal penthouse suites, right through to all the guest public areas. That's to me is what the space is what sets Crystal apart from around the main dining room, all the different dining venues, sorry, all the different cocktail bars, to the lovely um, entertainment, the choice of entertainment, right through to the um, pool area and all the choice, you know, you can literally follow the sun around the pool because there's that amount of space and that much choice of sunbeds. Quality. It's all very well being all inclusive, but if you're not offering the best quality, then what's the point? And I can assure you on Crystal, the quality is amazing. The level of the wines that are supplied is incredible. And um, I get asked by a few agents, some of you, if you're listening out there, I won't say who you are, but um, there's certain wines that Crystal um, have their own vineyard in California. We have a specific grape and vineyards just for, for us. And you can only get them on board our ship. So sometimes I have to do a little delivery to a few of my agents with these with these amazing wines. Um, 
Tony Award winning shows, we've teamed up with uh, Kevin McCollum and um, he um, has been in, you know, for productions like Rent and the Motown, the musical, um, and that is who is put, collaborated with and that's who puts all our entertainment together, um, right through to, as I've mentioned, the wine, the food. So quality is, is definitely very, very high and one of the reasons we win awards and the other reason, of course, is the choice. Because we're slightly larger vessels, we're able to offer a lot more choice. Um, now, that might be you choose to do some of the shore excursions or it could be the fitness. Um, we have Pilates classes, spinning classes involved, all the enrichment throughout the day, all the different, you know, learning how to use your iPad from art classes to learning a language to all the different lecture experiences. And of course, the spa, salons, the pool area, the saunas, all, you know, the sauna areas, all the spa are inc all included apart from treatments. Now, as far as shore excursions go, as I mentioned on our ocean, these aren't included. So what's the sort of thing you could expect to do if you came on Crystal Week? You could do maybe a walking tour or um, a coach trip to a castle. You could go to a vineyard or maybe a chocolate factory in Brussels. Um, or how about a private tour of the Sistine Chapel? Starting to go up slightly, a little bit more in price now. Maybe fly in a fighter um, mid jet in um, Russia across Russia, or how about um, with your pals for the Grand Prix, um, hiring a private apartment that looks out over the racetrack. So um, slightly different variety in, in choice, but there we go. Um, we cover all needs and all budgets with our shore excursions. So let's drill down and talk a little bit more about who the Crystal Guest is. So 82% are married, um, but here we go. 41% are new to Crystal. So there's a real, real chance here for you to be able to upgrade your customers that have perhaps been traveling on other cruise lines because 50% of them have been on one to three cruises in the last two years. If we get them on Crystal, it's like turning left on an airplane. They stay with us. Once you've got a, crystal on, a customer on Crystal, the hard work is done. We do all the rest. You sit back. They tend to travel with us every other year on average, and you will retain that commission, and that will come just come through automatically for you. Ninety-six percent of our customers are new. Uh, sorry, ninety percent of new to Crystal guests say they are likely to take another Crystal cruise with 97% likely to recommend it to their friends and family. So as I mentioned, if you've not sold Crystal before, what we, we find it so often with agents that have not sold us, they do that first booking and it's like a rocket. It just spreads. Their customers tell their friends and they have that confidence when their customers come back in. And then, as I said, that customer then ends up being a repeater for life. Why do people travel with us? Our reputation is one of the main reasons, followed quite closely behind by destination. As you all know, destination is a key factor, and we do travel all around the world um, on our two ocean ships. And then the date of the cruise for those special anniversaries. So what's the average age of a customer? It's a little bit tricky. Um, so straight away, um, my attention is brought to the yacht and this is very much a younger demographic. And um, I'll talk to you a little bit later about that. But on our ocean, the average age of our Crystal Society customers, our regular customers, is 68. Now, that's a little bit skewed because of our world cruise that happens between January and March. Let's be honest. If you're going on a world cruise, you are retired. So it really brings the age up. But then in the summer, you could have um, maybe somebody, you know, quite a lot of people in their 30s, 40s that will be doing our four or five night Grand Prix cruise. Or maybe Alaska in the summer, we get quite a few families that want to experience Alaska together. So it really brings the age down. I would say really typically, um, we're looking at retired market um, plus for our world cruises. And then if you're looking at a med cruise, you'd be looking at an average age of under 60 for a seven night med cruise. So just, just to give you an idea. River cruising, the average age, um, of our regular customers is just slightly under cruising, but but we know that river cruising attracts generally um, a more retired market. However, we are changing that. And I think if you've ever seen any of our river cruises, get a chance, go and have a look online. They've got a really young, fresh, contemporary feel about them. And um, we're seeing a little more couples in their 40s and 50s, a lot of couples in their 50s choosing to come on board with us on our river that are new. And they love the idea of sipping a martini up on the deck as they cruise along the Rhine. 
Now, I've mentioned yachts. Yacht really um, is a lot younger demographic and um, it's a totally different experience. It's only 62 customers, uh, very, very casual. So uh, Crystal Society is 62. We get a lot of repeaters that go on the yacht and they will just stay on that yacht and they won't go on any other product. It has out of all of our product, the highest guest um, satisfaction scores. I think 98.9% .9 um, guest satisfaction scores. It's amazing. And we're introducing a lot of new younger customers to the Crystal brand via our yacht. So talking about new customers then and... Um, yeah, let's start with the yacht, because as I said, we're introducing a lot of new customers to Crystal via the yacht. So 66% of the customers that come on the yacht have never been on Crystal. And actually, here's a fact, a lot of them have never even ever cruised. Um, and so if you've got a customer that's looking to dip their toe into the market, um, but they're not sure if they, you know, the idea of a big cruise ship is for them put the Esprit yacht and of course our new Endeavour Expedition yacht brochure in front of them. Um, just really small numbers, very immersive destination and um, that will really appeal to them. I always kind of call it second honeymooners as a sort of average age, you know, people that are perhaps mortgage free now, um, but still, you know, work and everything, but, but looking for an experience a little bit more sociable. Now, if we go on to, we haven't got the stats yet for 2018, but you can see really they haven't changed over the last few years. But on our ocean, 58% um, of our, our customers at Crystal Society, 40% are new. But interestingly, it really switches around on the river. And that is because with river cruising, whilst, yes, we're getting a lot of customers that are coming over from our ocean, we're getting an awful lot of customers that are new to Crystal but they've been on um, other brands, um, other ocean line brands. They've never done a river cruise. They fancy doing a river cruise. And up until now, they haven't had the confidence in knowing that there's a river cruise line out there that can offer them the service that they would expect if they've traveled on other luxury cruise lines. Now you have the confidence to be able to offer them a river cruise line that can, can offer them that. And um, as a result, we're seeing a lot of brand new people that come to our river cruise that haven't traditionally cruised with us, but they're trying river cruise with us for the first time and, of course, loving it. And then they're trying our ocean cruising, which is just fantastic. So just drilling down a little bit further. So cruising, um, slightly older customers, the baby boomers, pre-retirement and retired empty nesters they're looking for new experiences new cultures you know we always visit somewhere new on our world cruises and on symphony we always spend somewhere new for christmas for example sydney for new year on our river again as i would expect slightly higher customer very similar to our um, ocean slightly you know they they say that these travel needs are risk averse um, and conservative you know they want to do a city break but they want to be handheld and they want that city break to be all included for them. The yacht, completely the opposite, aimed at my generation, Generation X, as well as the baby boomers. Look at that difference in age range. This is, as I mentioned, a really great product and the yacht and the expedition to introduce new people to cruising and um, people that have that sense of adventure. So that's it from me. Hopefully we've answered a few, answered a few questions on who is a Crystal customer. And um, I'm going to play a little bit of a video now to, um, to finish with. And if you've got any questions, just let us know. What makes a memory last a lifetime? The kind you never tire of retelling, even decades later. One that warms the heart and carries you to wondrous points of view. Reviving childhood interests. Elevating your spirits. Giving birth to new aspirations. Moments of kinship. Where the little touches touch you and tiny details delight. Where each day holds the promise of infinite possibilities.
where beauty is tasted. Life celebrated. Masterful moments. Shared. Moments that bring you closer to those you love. Inspiring new adventures, new outlooks. Moments that renew you. How do you make memories that last a lifetime? With the world's most awarded luxury cruise line. Crystal, where luxury is personal.